Hi friends, let's do a check-in. I've been feeling overwhelmed lately, exhausted, lacking motivation and not resting enough. It's been taking a toll on my health, mentally, physically and emotionally. I've been on track with my 75 soft challenge, my academics, filming, working and as much as it's reaping its rewards, slowly but surely, it's also been taking a lot from me. I found myself sleeping in class, not doing the things I wanted to do properly, so I thought it would be the best time to do a reset. Let's return to the source, take care of ourselves, get our lives together and prepare for the next quarter. I hope this video will emphasize the importance of being healthy while you work and study. It's easy to get caught up in our to-do list, our commitments and our goals, but moving at a deficit does not yield positive results in the long run. So, join me and let's reset. Hi guys, welcome back to your favorite channel. If you're new here, welcome. And if you are a returning subscriber, welcome back home. As you guys can read by the title of this video, we are recovering from burnout. We are doing a reset. I am currently on recess. Some unis called recess, we call it VAC. I'm not too sure. But I am currently on VAC and I just haven't been vlogging. I mean, it's obvious because uh, my last vlog, I think, was two weeks ago. I also haven't really been doing a lot because I've just been burnt out. I've been really tired. Um, I feel like I was just putting myself through a lot in the first term. Second term starts in two days, so I wanted to get into that, you know, productive mindset, be motivated again, have a plan for second term because second term is going to be difficult especially because test week is coming up i really want to do well but also i've just been struggling with planning and we're just keeping my space great and clean um with this burnout if you guys are watching this video i hope you also get motivated to get your things in order and that you prepare really well for the second term because remember what i said we are going to be academic weapons this semester so much to do tonight's agenda is to do laundry and also clean up the kitchen space i haven't been home for the weekend i literally i came back yesterday so i just haven't been able to keep up it's a mess so what we're gonna do now is start with that because i cannot think when my kitchen is not clean i can't cook i can't do anything so i end up eating really unhealthy or not eating at all because i know that like i'd have to wash the dishes to eat so in order to avoid that let's clean the kitchen decided that I'm not gonna put myself like under scrutiny for it like your period is your period you guys know I'm doing 75 soft right and I'm currently on day 49 that's seven weeks but period calories don't count I did keep up with my exercises but my food was terrible my diet was terrible but I'm not gonna stress myself like to be honest like things were team I just wanted to explain the food because that this is not how i eat every day i've gotten better but the past week
guys it is the next day so as you guys saw i just did a little bit of my morning routine and i'm heading to the gym today is day 50 at 75 so i'm just very proud of myself i have 25 more days left the whole day planned and ugh, no ways this camera is heavy no ways why am i doing this to myself <laughs> So it's a bit later and I'm back from the gym. Uh, we are about to go grocery shopping. So I made a shopping list of things that I really, really, really need to get. Um, we are going to macro because I just want to stock up on a lot of things. I don't want to keep on buying basic foods. It was actually my friend's idea to do this. And I think it's a great idea because I don't want to keep on buying like rice or like oats and things like that. Rather keep on buying meats and vegetables but with the basic things it would be great to just have them in the house all the time my shopping list is washing powder milk canned tomatoes tea as in green tea noodles oats rice pasta and then veggies and fruits like apples bananas cucumbers avocado <laughs> bread lunch stuff so um i want to start carrying lunch boxes when i do go to school i have been doing that anyway but i still i just want to spice up my lunch box a bit so i want to get like the small juices cookies to add into that and i want to get spices like salt and like it's italian herbs and all the spices to cook so that is my shopping list i don't want to get in there black blind i don't just want to buy mindlessly so i thought it would be a great idea to have a shopping list and yeah guys so let's go grocery shopping doing grocery shopping but there's still a few things i need to get and my friend also needs to get so we are going to the mall now hopefully shops are still open because it is a public holiday but i think in at the mall it's a bit different you know so yeah i just wanted to give you guys a quick update and then we'll do a haul when i get home Guys, I'm going to check this and it's so overwhelming because it's so full. But I am trying to shop. morning guys it is day three of getting my life together we went to macro and then we went to checkers so at macro spent a thousand rand yeah in the black over here checkers it was 
334 she spends 1.4 on groceries so yeah guys let's quickly do this haul guys this is literally my grocery haul all of this was worth, worth 1.4 the other thing i was talking about in the beginning would see why would i deem this necessary is this i always buy these i feel like they just make my life easier instead of me like buying tomatoes and chopping 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 chop 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 oh reminds me meaning ting onions but this really really helps me makes life very easy and i also got lama juice for school i think i did explain it yesterday but yeah guys i'm very very satisfied i'm very happy i feel like some things will really last me like the jungle oats because i have oats a lot you guys have noticed rice is always running ours i'm also into apples lately so i'm really going to enjoy that i'm that this i've never bought a spice a singaga before and the smaller ones i've bought last a long time so i'm guaranteed to see this will last me longer the oil and oil is so expensive hey chutney i love i love chutney this lasted me very 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 long last year so it will now i've also never bought a usawoti that is so much i usually buy the tiny tiny ones so i know it's gonna last me i didn't buy a lot of milk because i'm not someone who has a lot of milk but i got some milk uh you guys know i'm lactose intolerant so i got some lactose free milk and yeah like every i got one avo because avocado can easily just rot and i don't need those type of problems right now but this is what we have very satisfied very, very satisfied but anyway uh we are about to go buy my textbooks um buy my textbooks because i didn't get an opportunity to buy them in the first term and it's quite late in the term to do this but it's okay i was using my old legislation i can't even say the word i was using my old legislation very excited like i've been waiting to buy my textbooks oh my goodness but yeah this is just my outfits guys i think literally the whole theme of this video is just me in pink anyway before i talk too much let us go buy my textbooks I forgot to buy washing powder yesterday. Guys, I'm going to do an overcooler in my ear pill. I just got into the coat. I also got some sparkling water. Okay, guys, I'm at PNA now. Just going to do some stationery shopping. This is the most exciting part, actually. Because the pencil cases here aren't aesthetic. Like, so I'm just going to go check a typo in Mr. Price because. Okay. I might come back for these because I study with I have a whiteboard at home so I might come back for these because these are nice this is so cool guys this is so nice but I came in for stationery shopping it's amazing but guys the stationery and the price is into the rank we're just gonna go to typo oh it's quite a fun I'm gonna put it in my cart and think about it. Guys, we are back at PA because I forgot I to buy covers. So I'm just looking for covers for my textbook. So these, these ones, these remind me of primary. It's true. I might get this huge book. Okay, 
hey guys so it's a bit later i just took my pre-workouts i also changed because i'm going to the gym i wasn't gonna go to the gym because i am in so much pain but 75 soft i just want to quickly show you all the things i got so remember we went to pna like 50 times in and out not sure then sure then not sure again but this is what i got for pna i've never bought a book this huge actually now that i think about it i got these covers that we spoke about okay so these are the bookies these rem literally remind me of primary school i got some i got colored paper i'm going to be using the pink colored paper to make a cover for the for this book this is what we got from typo I got this new pink bottle but this is more for luggage it's not really a pencil case but i'll be using it as a pencil case it matches but these are the auditing books so far this is the tax legislation to catch up flagging for those books and then the rest i'll get them uh during the week when i go to school everyone's been talking about the, this, this, this as well. And these tights match with this set. So remember, it's Kwama. So I said, Mr. Price, I took it back. I just felt like it really was a waste of money because I'm also on a strict budget. Some of the textbooks, like I said, I'm going to get them as the week goes by. So you guys won't be there for that. But that is my haul. I just got what I needed and I'll keep on working on buying everything as the week goes by. But otherwise, I am going to prepare for the gym right now. I've quite a bit to do. Yeah, this video, oh, I'm so, like, I'm grateful. Okay, I'm overwhelmed, but I'm very grateful because I'm just grateful. Like, to be able to buy textbooks, to be able to buy stationery, to buy groceries, to be able to have the means to do these things for school is very i'm so grateful for my scholarship because i'd be nowhere without them child so i'm just really grateful that um i was able to get the things that i needed and i'm still going to get the things that i need like i said via textbook sensationary but for now grateful blessed wouldn't want it any wouldn't want it any else Hmm. Time listening is would it want it any more any any difference? I think wouldn't want it any different, yeah. But you know, tonight, by the end of tonight, I don't care what time I sleep, I have to be done. I want to be done. Laundry must be packed. Okay, dishes, okay, my dishes are washed. But like my house must be spick and span, everything must be ready. Like I'm so tired. And then tomorrow the only thing I'll do. Excuse me. And then tomorrow I can just focus on school work. Like I am so tired, man. Guys, I use this for Amapela to keep them away in case you guys want a quick fix. It really helps.
also got these from spa i don't think i showed you guys but they are remember i wanted to get the like the 10 piece from pna but then i remembered i got this from spa i forgot how much it was but it was definitely less than 50 rand oh, this is how it is it's it's kind of surreal but i'm really excited for you guys to see all the clips le chalet midnight and i don't want to procrastinate further so i, I put my glasses on because my eyes are hurting but i really want to finish the laundry <laughs> Finally done. What time is it? Anyway, guys, I love you so much. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and comment a white heart if you made it up to this part of the vlog. I love you a lot. <laughs> hey, hey.